everybody. Um, for the chapter book switch, we are going to switch to Frog and Toad Together by Arnold Lobel. I don't know if you preschoolers remember, but we voted a while ago and it was a very close vote between Jack and Annie and Frog and Toad. So since we read Jack and Annie first, now we're going to get to Frog and Toad. And the first chapter is called A List. All right, here we go. One morning, Toad sat in bed. I have many things to do, he said. I will write them all down on a list so that I remember them. Toad wrote on a piece of paper, a list of things to do today. Then he wrote, wake up. I have done that said Toad, and he crossed out, wake up. And there is Toad in his bed making his list. Then Toad wrote other things on the paper. Eat breakfast, get dressed, go to Frog's house, take walk with Frog, eat lunch, take nap, play games with Frog, eat supper, go to sleep. There, said Toad, now my day is all written down. He got out of bed and had something to eat. Then Toad crossed out, eat breakfast. Toad took his clothes out of the closet and put them on. Then he crossed out, get dressed. Toad put the list in his pocket. He opened the door and walked out into the morning. Soon Toad was at Frog's front door. He took the list from his pocket and crossed out, go to Frog's house. Toad knocked at the door. Hello, said Frog. Look at my list of things to do, said Toad. Oh, said Frog, that is very nice. Toad said, my list tells me that we will go for a walk. All right, said Frog. I'm ready. There they are. Frog and Toad went on a long walk. Then Toad, Toad took the list from his pocket again. He crossed out, take walk with Frog. Just then there was a strong wind. It blew the list out of Toad's hand. The list blew high up into the air. Help! cried Toad. My list is blowing away. What will I do without my list? Oh no. Hurry, said Frog. We'll run and catch it. No, shouted Toad. I cannot do that. Why not? asked Frog. Because, wailed Toad, running after my list is not one of the things that I wrote on my list of things to do today. Frog ran after the list. He ran over hills and swamps, but the list blew on and on. At, la at last, Frog came back to Toad. I am sorry, gasped Frog, but I could not reach your list. Blah, said Toad. What is he going to do? I cannot remember any of the things that were on my list of things to do. I will just have to sit here and do nothing, said Toad. Toad sat and did nothing. Frog sat with him. After a long time, Frog said, Toad, it is getting dark. We should be going to sleep now. Go to sleep, shouted Toad. That was the last thing on my list. Toad wrote on the ground with a stick, go to sleep. Then he crossed out, go to sleep. There, said Toad. Now my day is all crossed out. I am glad, said Frog. Then Frog and Toad went right to sleep. All right. That is the end of this chapter. The next chapter is called The Garden. All right, see you on Monday.